Hi everyone, the Uniqlo U Spring Summer 2023 collection has just dropped so of course I had to run off to my local mall and check things out for myself. I already made a list of everything that I wanted to look at and try on ahead of time. I already had an idea of what sizes that I wanted to grab so we are just going to go ahead, try everything on and then I'm going to let you know about sizing as well. Before we begin, I'm going to ask you to please smash that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up as well. If you are a big Uniqlo U fan, this is how you can support my channel. Now on my shopping excursion, I just wore a very basic outfit, leather jacket, white t-shirt, black trousers, Maison Margiela sneakers because I know this is going to look beautiful with the Uniqlo U collection, a La Mer belt, and then my La Mer bag. Alright, let's start with the first look from Uniqlo U. In this one, I'm wearing the Jersey Taylor jacket in a size extra small and the Jersey suit pant. I find the neutral color on this suit to be incredibly flattering, especially on me. I've always loved the idea of a white suit, but I can't pull it off because it has a tendency to look very clinical on me. So the fact that this one is a nice off-white color is just really awesome. I also love the idea of wearing a suit like this casually with a pair of sneakers, wearing it as separate, or even wearing it to an office. If you work in an office, this is a great suit for the spring and summer because it's a very nice light jersey fabric. It's not too heavy, but it really has a nice shape. Now here I'm trying on the Uniqlo U ribbed long sleeve cardigan in a size extra small. I definitely think that the extra small is maybe not the best fit on me. I feel like it's too shrunken and I'm not very comfortable in this light color. The color is beautiful though. It's not too yellow. It's not too brown. It truly is the perfect neutral and I will have to try this on in the black color because I really like the cardigan. I just don't like this color on myself. I did size up with the pants. I felt like the size two was a little too small. Um, it was kind of puckering around the hips, so a size four is definitely better and it looks more relaxed as well. Now here I'm wearing the Uniqlo U sleeveless t-shirt. This is the first time that Uniqlo U and Christophe Lemaire are doing active wear as part of the collection. They did style this with a yoga pant. There is a matching yoga pant that goes with this. I tried on the extra small in that shirt and I love the color, but I am going to be sizing up to a size small. I feel like the extra small is just a little too tight around my bust. I do love how the suit looks with black accessories though, especially with this La Mer belt. This one is the double buckle one. It's currently on sale on Essence, so I am going to be linking it down in the description box below. I think it looks great with those Maison Margiela sneakers as well. Now something that I really love about the Uniqlo U collection is that the quality is really good. You're getting some really good stuff for this price point and the details on this blazer are really gorgeous. Like that hidden pocket in there is something that I didn't expect and I was actually really blown away with that. Now here I'm trying on the Uniqlo U sleeveless t-shirt in a size extra small. Again, I have to size up and this one is in the dark gray color. It does have a little bit of blue to it so um, I kind of see it as a bluish gray to be honest. The jeans are the curved jeans from the Uniqlo U collection and these ones are in a size 26. I do find that they fit true to size and they're very flattering. Again, I'm 5'4 and I feel like it's the perfect length on me. However, I did cuff them just a little bit to show off my shoes. Now here I'm wearing the sleeveless cardigan in a size extra small. I love the fit of it and it's the kind of thing that you don't have to wear a shirt underneath because it's quite modest. These are also the jogger pants in a size 2. This is in the color olive. I love the pleats in the front. I think that that drawstring at the hemline is very fun as well. So you can kind of play around with the silhouette of the pants a little bit. And the color, the fit, everything on this jogger is absolutely phenomenal. By the way, I'm going to be linking everything down in the description box below. So here I'm trying on the sheer short sleeve shirt. This one is in a size extra small. I always love the idea of a shirt like this on other people. However, when I try it on for myself, it doesn't suit my aesthetic. I think it's because my style has a tendency to lean towards the masculine side. So when I pair masculine piece with a masculine piece, it's almost too overwhelming and it doesn't flatter me. This is a great shirt though. And they have some really pretty colors as well. Like they have this creamy yellow, this pink color color and then they have a striped version as well. All right, next up, I'm going to be trying on that long sleeve cardigan in a size small this time, and this is in the black color. I absolutely love the black color, and I was really hoping that this cardigan would work out for me because I realized I don't have a short cardigan in a black color in my wardrobe, so I feel like this would really be filling a hole that I have in my wardrobe. 
I think it looks great with the joggers and I'm so obsessed with these pants that I'm going to be trying them on in the dark gray as well. The truth is that I wasn't originally drawn to the dark gray just because it does have a little bit of that blue tint to it. However, the fit on these is so flattering that I had to try them on and I'm so glad that I did because it looks great with that Uniqlo U vest. This one is in a size extra small. I think it looks great with that La Mer double buckle belt that I decided to style it with and even with those Maison Margiela sneakers. Everything about this is just like like it's giving me spring vibes. I am ready for the weather to change. The fabric on the pants is just really nice and lightweight and it looks beautiful when paired with that woven vest and even the woven cardigan from this collection. So I did have to stop by the accessories and those Uniqlo U bucket bags are so cute. This one is in the medium size. I really do think that they should have called it small because it's quite a small bag and then they have the large version as well. I'm very tempted to get one. However, I'm trying to be very thoughtful about anything that gets added to my wardrobe. I also tried on the hooded long coat. This one is in a size extra small in the beige color on my way out. I love the length of this coat. I think it's incredibly flattering. I love the slight oversized fit as well. And it also has a nice water repellent finish on it. If it does wear off, you can always just respray it and you're good to go. So I'm gonna be doing a part two, which is gonna be my try on haul. So make sure that you do subscribe to my channel and smash that like button. That is everything for this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you picked up and I will see you in the next video. Bye.